documentary to make because uh, Pantages Theater Art Society was like, uh, not a lot of people in the society really wanted to talk about it because they were pretty distraught about the outcome of the theater. So it was hard enough to get uh, contact with them and then people from the city definitely didn't want to talk about it because in their minds the issue had been resolved and there wasn't really much left to say about it. And then also um, a couple months earlier the people had been going on a tour through the theater and the floorboards collapsed. So they were having legal issues there, so we actually didn't have access to the theater either. So all those things against us were like, well, what are we going to film? So we just kind of uh, decided to um, we decided to go through to different areas of the city and try and kind of capture what, from our readings and our interviews, what we thought the theater might have been like. So we went to the Biltmore and Cots in Burlesque, and then we went to the Rio Theater and filmed the old projector there because it used to be a cinema house, and then. We went. Uh, we got permission to film in the Orpheum Theater just for a couple cutaways of an actual theater, and we pieced it together. And uh, and Peter and Nathan's uh, opinions and arguments were pretty uh, pretty uh, powerful. So it uh, it ended up coming together as something. So they they were happy with it. So that's all that counts. Yeah, I was very impressed with how it how it was uh, like for how many how long is it now? Not eight. It's like yeah, eight minutes and. Like how well told the story is in that short period.